You want to see a transformation? Wait, no judgment allowed. But if you're cool, let's go see what we did. This is my closet. It took me two months to clean and I finally finished it off in a solid last push. The majority of the cleaning that I did on this video happened just a couple of minutes at a time on nights when I felt I could after I brushed my teeth. I would just take a couple of things out of the closet that I didn't want anymore and put them in a donation bag. The donation bag lived in the closet. Then on two different days, I got down to business and just finished the rest. If you have issues cleaning, if you have ADHD or if you have really limited time or energy, I myself get completely paralyzed with this much to do, or I used to, but I have like a technique and it works. It is called category cleaning. I'm sure that there are other names for this, but that's what I call it. And rather than torturing myself about where everything's going to go or an organizing system, I just put everything in categories. I had a big bucket for things that didn't belong in the closet. I had a bucket for stuff that went into my office. I put all of the mail that I knew was something I probably need to hold on to into some clear buckets because I cannot deal with organizing papers after doing all this work. And I'm not even going to stress myself out. Not every single thing needs to be solved in one go. I put shoes in one area. I put stuff for trash in a bag. I put stuff for giveaway in a bag. I just basically completely turned my brain off. I wanted to be very basic about the categories that I was using. I only did these last two pushes on a day when I did not have to take care of the kids. I had a couple of hours carved out where I was going to be able to just put on a show and ignore everybody. And when I didn't have so much going on that I'd be exhausted later. So this is what happened. I've taken a few days to take everything that I removed from the closet and deal with that. And I'm so proud of myself for not pushing myself too hard or quitting.